In July, they were charged with aggravated murder and rape of their five-year-old granddaughter. Today, Sonia and Richard Green took the next steps towards the trial. 13 News reporter Natalie Wattis was in court. She joins us with an update. Sonia and Richard Green entered court, then sat silently without apparent emotion as the lawyers for both sides met in chambers with the judge for today's hearing. Today is set for what's called a pretrial conference. That's not the actual trial. It's an opportunity where the judge gets together with the attorneys on the case, make sure all the issues are being addressed, make sure discovery is being provided, and all the, all the little things that the attorneys talk about. Sonia and Richard Green, both of New Boston, were arrested after their five-year-old granddaughter Annabelle died in a Columbus Children's Hospital. She had been life flighted there July 8th after police were called on a report of an injured child. Annabelle and two siblings had been placed in Scioto County Children's Services into the foster care of the Greens three months earlier. Initially charged with aggravated murder, assault, and child endangerment, a grand jury indicted both of the Greens in August with additional charges of rape. Both have pleaded not guilty to all the charges. Right now we're in the discovery phase where we're getting evidence together, taking a look at the evidence and evaluating the case. Today's pretrial hearing took place in chambers, but attorneys from both sides tell us this is just the first of many for this case. Richard Green Jr., Annabelle Bell's father was outside the courtroom today. He had lost custody of his children due to an addiction to drugs, but says he is now sober and wants ultimate justice. I believe that they should have death row because of this. You know, all the charges and everything else like that, any parent would want that. A second pretrial hearing will be scheduled for later this month. Reporting in Portsmouth, Ohio, I'm Natalie Wattis. 13 News, working for you. Now, the defense attorneys also tell 13 News today that the Greens waived their rights to a speedy trial in order to give them more time to prepare for the case.